Hey guys, what is up? Welcome back to the channel and today for the second time we're doing a legacy showcase following the one for Claudio Gadelli that we did a few months ago. And as you can see, we are in danger early with Donald Cerrone, but not to worry because he's been in that situation many times. He is a man with the second most finishes in UFC history with 16. He has the second most wins at 23 and he's 20 knockdowns are an octagon record so all around very entertaining fighter to watch as i hope you will find this fight to be too we have further legacy showcases coming up this week for Ioana e on jacek and the way to tell that they are legacy showcases for future reference will be the fact that we are going back to the old great thumbnail style with the red text so that's what we're going to do for legacy showcases but yeah i don't think there is many people more deserving than no doubt a future hall of famer in donald Cerrone. so i hope you guys do enjoy the showcase if you have any further video ideas and you would like me to know them or make videos on them please do feel free to drop them in the comments if you are new around here please drop the video a like and subscribe to the channel before you leave thanks guys i'll catch you next time bye bye Working off of his back here. Looks like he may try to hip escape. Well, he's more than content to work off of his back, DC, where he has been a magician in his UFC career. All right, so he postures up here and now figures to rain down some ground strikes. Yeah, the ground and pound will be a plenty from this position. So we pull up the stats for you now. 32 total strikes have landed for Donald Cerrone. Looking to land the right just out of range. One minute. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Oh, well done to block the elbow. That's good defense. And he lands a punch there. Pretty good connection by him. Great connection. He's in a great flow right now. 30 seconds now to go in round one. Ground and pound strikes here, DC. This could be the beginning of the end. I mean, you gotta be very careful when you take these big ground and pound strikes. You need a controlled posture on the bottom. How about those five minutes? <laughs> Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Oh, man, that was slick. Oh, 
Oh, looks like he's trying to isolate an arm, maybe set up a Kimura here, DC. Yeah, and now he falls back into the finishing position. So the he tap 